welcome to Beauty Kitty Studios doing another Shein nail video. So all of their nails come with um, a little file and then double sided nail adhesive. I usually don't use those though. So I always line everything up so I'm totally prepared and then I always prep my nail beds. When people ask how long these nails last, my answer is usually it depends on how you prepare your nails. This is my best trick for keeping nails on much longer. So you prep the cuticles, move the cuticles down gently, though you don't want to harm your cuticles. Um, this is more of just the cleanliness, just so it looks better, so you look, it looks more professional. And then after doing that, you just kind of file down the sides. That's when I use the file that the Shein nails provide. Um, so their nails don't come with these, but I will try to provide links um, in this video. I usually try to provide links in the video for getting these tools and supplies because they don't come with them. So then I use a little gentle buffer and I buff the tops of my nail beds and around the sides. And this again will help the glue to stick better. I'm not damaging the nail beds, I'm just buffing them just a little bit so it's kind of roughed up. So the glue has something to hold on to. These are pretty easy to come by. Um, so yeah, I'll put links in there if you have any questions about these. And then clean up the dust because you don't want that sticking to the glue. And then I usually use alcohol pads, but it's just as easy as using rubbing alcohol on a paper towel or napkin. And then I start with the glue. Um, I go one nail at a time. I always start with my thumb on my left hand side. I put on regular nail glue first and then I use a brush glue to brush it around. This helps to even it out so you don't get any little air bubbles under the nails. And then I put the nail on starting at the cuticle and then I push it down towards the rest of the nail bed. And then hold it down on the sides, pinch the sides. So when you get glue on matte finished nails, keep a little napkin with rubbing alcohol on it on you and wipe towards your skin. Don't wipe on the nail, wipe the glue off towards your skin. Because you, with matte finished nails, it's so easy to get that clumpy glue look, like that dried glue. Which is again why I go one nail at a time. That way I'm less likely to make a huge mess because I am super clumsy. <laughs> so yeah, with these I always wipe the glue towards my skin. And then just go to the next nail, one nail at a time. Before I actually press the nails on too, I make sure that there isn't any glue on my fingers because that's another way to get that dried glue onto your matte nails is if there's residual glue left on those fingers. And then I, I always roll the nail side to side. So press the nail, pinch the nail on the sides, and roll the nail side to side. And this pushes all that glue and helps it to dry way more evenly. Actually, if you hadn't noticed, I had to change glue bottles there. The first one dried out. That's why I always have extra glue on hand. I really like these nails. They're super durable. They're pinched, so they have that little C curve at the, you know, along the length of the nail, which adds um, some durability to the nail. There's also so many ways to dress them up if you don't like a plain nail, or if you have them plain for like one week and they're still on and you want to add some decals or stones. Some foil too, like a marble foil would look cool. Something else really fun to do with their Shein nails because they are so affordable 
is to switch up the boxes. So there's a set that they have that's kind of like this iridescent, like grayish blue set, and I'll do a video on that here soon. But adding one of those to this, like as an accent nail, or um, if you want to have fun with it, do like one hand one color and the other hand another color. So there's a lot of really fun ways to use these nails. I say stock up on them. They're such a great price and I'm, I'm really excited because uh, I just got all of their new extra long nails. It's kind of hard to get a hold of them really fast because people buy them out so, so, so fast. So what I do when I go to Shein is I go to the new items list and I click on new items or new arrivals and then I click beauty or nails and you should be able to see the latest newest arrivals of nails and try to get a hold of them before they sell out. That's what I did. I was kind of thinking, do I want to buy all of these right now? And then I just knew if I didn't, they would be gone. And sure enough, I looked the next day and half of the nails were already sold out. One set of nails sold out within five hours. It was insane. They were the light blue set of nails with the clear nail with the blue butterflies, um, just like the yellow set. So I'm really excited to show that, show that video soon. And not everybody knows this, but these actual nails aren't designed or made by Shein. They just happen to sell them at a great price. So you've probably seen these on eBay or Amazon or DHgate or um, AliExpress or other websites. They usually tend to sell them from $8 to $12, so Shein has a pretty good price at $2. And then if you've seen my other videos, you'll know that I always finish with a cuticle oil. This particular oil I got at a Dollar Tree store, that's what it's called here. So there isn't a link for it, but if you would like, I have a link to another Sally Hansen one that I absolutely love that I can send you. Or I'll put it in the information. So there are matte finish nails. Um, so then I always wipe the nail bed because I don't want the oil to make, you know, to make the matte finish all shiny looking. Especially if you're doing, you know, photography or videos with your hands. And there you go. Another easy $2 set of nails from Shein. Thank you so much for watching. Your support means the world to me. And I will see you all next time. I